tonight. So continuing some of the coverage, we want to bring in now WLWT News 5's Daisy Kershaw. So she talked tonight with our Ohio GOP Chairman Alex Trantafilu. And Daisy, what did he have to say? I mean, he's getting ready for the convention next week and gets this news. Mike Cherie, that's right. The Republican National Convention is just two days away, and although it starts Monday, many from the party are already in Milwaukee or heading there tonight. Ohio GOP Chairman Alex Triantafilu was at his hotel in Milwaukee when he got word about the shooting. I caught up with him on the phone just a short time later. This is what he had to say. We are hard at work and we're, we are actively working to set up uh, for our delegation experience in Milwaukee at the Republican National Convention. So I'm at the uh, our assigned hotel and I was working and um, my wife, who happens to be with me, came in and told a stunned group of volunteers what was transpiring. And I asked him if he has any concerns heading into the convention in light of today's shooting. He tells me the security is always incredibly tight and this will be his sixth RNC. He says right now he doesn't have any immediate safety concerns. I also asked if he anticipates there being any changes to this year's convention. He tells me it's still too early to say. The chairman says he is keeping the former president and all of those impacted in his prayers. I pray that for their safety and their well-being and um, you know, I pray for our country. I, fundamentally, uh, uh, we are we are a, a, a inflection point, and today uh, is a day that we won't soon forget. Donald Trump was rumored to be announcing his running mate at the RNC this week. Again, we're hearing that, thankfully, the former president is expected to be okay. Tonight, a senior advisor from Trump's campaign saying Trump will be at the convention next week to proceed with his nomination as planned. Daisy Kershaw, WLWT News 5.